So we, we're, we're talking the other day uh, about the amount of people who don't finish books. Hmm. You, you, you know, you, you've worked with, I don't know how many authors you've worked with. Um, and I mean, I'm, I've seen the graphics because, you know, when we work together uh, and, you know, we still work together now, but seeing the graphics of all the bestsellers come through there and seeing just printing bestsellers. Why? It, what is the biggest barrier that you've seen barrier or barriers that you've seen for why authors can't finish books or aspiring authors can't finish books? Distractions. I'll give you three. Not necessarily in order. Distractions is the biggest one. They get distracted. They lose focus. And distractions are the death of your dreams happening in slow motion. Number two reason why many authors don't finish writing their book is their why is not big enough. They don't have big enough why. My very first book, I wrote was about my father's business, the life and wisdom of Mose Jones, my dad, your granddad. Geneva, my sister, your aunt, came to me one day. She says, Frederick, you really need to get that book finished before daddy dies. And I'm like, oh, gosh. She's, you know. And sure enough, I got that book finished. And then uh, it was December of 2006. Had a big event in Atlanta, Georgia. And after a big event in Atlanta, Georgia, Daddy came back to me and said, now this here, this ain't right, this ain't right. He was very thankful, very appreciative. He said, now this ain't right, this needs to be changed. Matter of fact, he burned up 300 books. He burned up 300 books because they wasn't right. I didn't say Mr. about some of the other people in the book, and I didn't show the level. He burned those books up because they wasn't right. It was May. I rewrote the books, re-edited them, got them all right. It was May or June that daddy looked at those books and he said, now this is right, this is right. And he approved those books and he, he loved those books and sold those books out of his truck. He said, now this is right, this is right. Very, very proud. November 2007, daddy died. So your why has got to be big enough and you don't want to be living with regrets. And I've seen so many people live with regrets. They get sick and they, they regret. So number one reason they don't finish is they, they get distracted. Number two, their why is not big enough. And number three, they don't have an accountability partner. They don't have somebody or a coach to hold them accountable to get it done. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's good. Because, I mean, I have, you know, I've written two Three, if you count the ebook, a couple. Of, I've written four books because mm -hmm. you helped me, mm -hmm. right? You helped me. Both of them became bestsellers with the uh, with the paperbacks that I did. Uh, but I have another one I'm working on right now, and it's been sitting in my backpack mm -hmm. for a couple of months. Mm -hmm. I went through, made rough edits, and I need to go back and put the edits in the computer. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. you're right. I haven't. I haven't. I haven't taken that time. And been like, hey, Dad, I'm working on this book, or I'm working on getting out another version of this book. So you're right. All those things are right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's help, 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 help the people out, though. Help mm -hmm. the people out. Somebody is listening right now. Somebody is watching right now. They're saying, I hear Dr. Fred. I hear him talking about these books. I hear him talking about why people aren't getting books out. Somebody is listening. They're an entrepreneur. They're driven. They're determined. Can we, can we help the people out? And can we tell the people how they can get a book published? Yes, you can get a book published fast if you want to get a book published fast. You just go to kdp.amazon.com, kdp.amazon.com, and go there and set up your Kindle Direct Publishing Company, okay? Put in your bank account information, your name, and put in your social security number. You got to pay the taxes, right? Mm -hmm. And then uh, set up your Kindle Direct Publishing account. Then once you get your account set up right there, then you go to the next page, and it's going to hit the button that says Bookshelf, Create, and just create a Kindle ebook. Don't try to write a paperback book first. You, don't, you, 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 you will not need a back to the book. You just All you need is just a, a cover and, a, and the content. That's all you need. If you really want to get a book published fast, just, you'll just do, the cover, do an e-book. And an e-book is just one inch away from a print book. Once you get the e-book completed, then you just put a back to it. And now you got your paperback book. But kdp.amazon.com will get you a book published fast if you want to go there and get the book f published fast that's the quickest way i know and by the way 
uh, uh, Amazon is the largest book distributor in the world. And uh, it's, it's the number one go-to. It started off as a book company, okay? So people get Amazon. They, 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 I don't know what it is about hating on success. Uh, we we sometimes want to put down on, on companies that are successful. But Amazon is the largest book distributor platform out there. And for everyday people who want to get a book published, who want to become a bestseller, who want to start a business with a book, there is no better way to do it than on Amazon. I am, I'm exclusively publishing on Amazon. So kdp.amazon.com, you can get a book started there fast.